Yo guys, it's your boy Catch Me TV. We are heading to Austin for the EMLS Cup. I'll see you guys soon. We just arrived Austin, Texas. We'll be heading straight to the Q2 Stadium um, to go see where it's happening. We are live at the Q2 Stadium. Yeah, uh, we came into the VIP entrance and we'll be heading straight to uh, where the event is maj majorly happening. As we can see here, uh, they're already having the EMLS uh, ads and everything going. Amazing, man. And of course, you know the vibe. Um, the event is going to be played in the field club. That's the current standing, guys. All right, folks, we are at the peach itself, the Q2 stadium itself, boys. Um, love to see it, love to see it. Yeah, I'm going to be uh, catching some content with um, a couple of, uh, you know, uh, pro players here. Uh, possibly it's going to be one of these two, most definitely. <laughs> we got my man, Gustavo, right here, man. Amazing, amazing. Now, you know, um, this year has been, he's just been insane, man. Honestly, what got you into uh, competitive gameplay? Honestly, it was just random. I always like to play and it got to one point that i started playing online that was like almost 10 years ago it's uh -huh. been a lot started playing online but didn't know anything about competitive and started meeting new people online and some of my friends are like you're really good you should try to go to this tournament first tournament i play i won and after that i just Pick kept looking i kept, kept looking for tournaments and wow. started looking up for for opportunities and nice. that's how it started nice. so, yeah. so how do you feel being one of the four automatically on the stage on sunday oh my god that <laughs> that feels so good right uh, last few years i wasn't there right. so i know how is the feeling of being playing right for the group stage as well uh -huh. but being in this position now it's way better Amazing, it's just right? yeah can relax, just watch just relax important. practice a little bit and exactly get ready for the big day awesome I feel like right now if i have one player to pick it has to be holland i appreciate you but i think ah, you so thank, you, thank you thank you all right guys we got the main man polo neto and you guys you guys know the story he's just like he's dominating any man it's, it's just amazing man how do you how do you feel like dominating the whole any scene bro uh i feel nice like it's, it's good like to see the all the trophies and yeah i just want to keep like that and hopefully it will be a good weekend you won um sellers one like you know i think people are saying oh yeah he's got like one two three four like you know how, like what was what was that moment for you like yeah, it was very special, like to become the first MLS pro to win four titles in MLS was really, really, really special. So uh, I'm just happy for that. And yeah, I just want to keep uh, keep going and make my 51 this weekend. I've noticed that you don't show too much emotions, even when they score against you. You just stay calm. Like, how do you do it? I don't know. I think that this is like with the time, like since I've played a lot of tournaments, so I keep, I'm now used to it. So mm -hmm. I'm used to the pressure. Mm -hmm. So I can stay calm in every situation. But yeah, I'm, I'm trying to be more reactive sometimes. Right. I'm just trying, but sometimes I just don't react. Yeah. So yeah, if you have a preferred formation, you know, what, what particular formation do you normally use that, you know, that's done lots of work for you? Yeah, I think that I'll need to say 4 3 2 1 is the, one that's most used then yeah it's one that works best for me okay what's your most favorite player this year nah man like he's the f the player that i hate the most when i'm <laughs> playing against and also yeah he's the best one in my team talent 
you, man. Bro, I appreciate you for taking Thank the time you. to you know, talk to appreciate us. Man. That, Many man. blessings, brother. Thank you. Ole. Ole, ole, ole. <laughs> Awesome guys. Now we have my man on a little here. How do you, you know, get into that spirit of like, hey, I'm gonna dominate my opponent and I'm gonna win? Like, what get into your head? I think it's a very good question. Um, I think for me, it's always about winning. You know, uh, every game I go into, I want to win. Mm -hmm. And I think if you look at the all around like regular series where we had 21 games, I lost one game out of wow. 21 and won 15 and drew four. So. <laughs> I mean, every game that I go into, I want to win it. You know, I'm I'm not like looking for a loss for like uh, a draw. Uh, I just want to go in and show people that I'm here. You know, right. So, what made you choose EMLS as uh, a place to want to compete, <laughs> or where you reached out to? I think uh, it's a very established league, mm -hmm. uh, arguably one of the best leagues, if not the best league. Mm -hmm. um, so. I'm very, very happy to be here. Uh, this year, I think it's more competitive than ever, as you have like a few other players that are coming in from uh, Europe, especially. Mm -hmm. So, um, yeah, I mean, MLS for me has been, as I said, the biggest league and probably uh, one of the most uh, best leagues in terms right. of how it looks. Mm -hmm. So, uh, yeah, that was why. Awesome. Yeah. So, like, is there a particular formation that you love playing with? Uh, I would say the best formation in my formation is 4-3-2-1. 4-3-2-1. Yeah. Wow. Yeah. Nice. So, yeah, um, if you have advice for folks that want to get better. Yeah. What advice would you have for them? Good question. I think the thing I always try to say is uh, believe in yourself. I think that's the thing that got me to the position I am in today. Um, but also the fact that you need to put down a lot of work. Mm -hmm. I think for me, I've always uh, maybe prioritized uh, practicing instead of, you know, going out partying and such, you know. Nice. Uh, and I mean, in the end of the day, I dedicated a lot of my life to this esports, you know. Nice. Uh, and I think that's what got me to this kind of place uh, right. why i've been winning like both like trophies in europe but also like worldwide right so um yeah i think these two things and also i think a good thing that i want to say is that's always good for you is to always put your name out there right starting to stream a bit mm -hmm. uh, starting to take your brand a bit more seriously mm -hmm. and uh, i think that's also helping for clubs to like see you as see a player you. as well yeah. so i would say these three things are the main things I think. when you moved from uh, you know europe to yeah. NA, like yeah. Was it a culture shock for you? Yeah, I think it's a very good question. I think I've been here before uh, oh, okay. in the US. So I won my first ever major tournament here mm -hmm. uh, in Atlanta. That was back in 2020. Yeah. So uh, I've been here before. Oh, nice. um, but I think, I mean, this uh, country from what I've been through has been amazing. You know, uh, I think everyone is very respectfully, very open. Uh, in terms of being uh, a Swedish player myself, I think we are a bit more like reserved. Who would you say is your strongest opponent? In EMLS, I would say there is like a very high level in terms of how many players they have. And then I think the average is maybe a bit worse than some other like European leagues. Mm -hmm. um, but I would say you have a lot of players. You have uh, Paolo Nieto, for example, who won uh, League Season 1. Uh, you have uh, my good friend Gustavo, mm -hmm. who is really, really good. But you have more players. You have K1 John, you mm -hmm. have Lamps, Diogo, mm -hmm. Yafonso, who is, who is from Portugal. So, I mean, this year, I think, as I said, I think is the, one of the most competitive leagues this year. Yes. But I would say there is uh, at least five or six players that I really believe can win it on Sunday. Yeah. yeah. How about you? You think you win? You can win on Sunday? Uh, I believe in myself. Uh, I think I, I've been playing good, like recently. Our uh, squad for this uh, in, in last cup is pretty good. Um, but then again, I like to be a bit more humble. Awesome. I appreciate you, brother. Thank you so much for taking Likewise, man. Likewise. You know, to chat with us. Thank you so much. Again. Likewise. Thank you. All right, guys, that was awesome, man. Uh, we just interviewed a couple of um, pro players here. Um, amazing individual. You can you can see that they are all humble, hum humble guys. You know, yeah, they, they, they know they're good, but they still, you know, remain humble as much as they can. And we're live here at the Q2 Stadium for the uh, Austin FC uh, um, Soccer Club. Uh, we'll be right live here again tomorrow for the actual game. Uh, they'll be playing against St. Louis FC. Um, and I support you know, St. Louis FC as well. So yeah, I'll be here to watch the game as well. And thanks to EMLS for um, providing us um, um, a ticket for that game. Um, but yeah, uh, I'll be, you know, you know, giving you guys some, some uh, you know, live, um, you know, videos and shots of, uh, of the actual game. Uh, but I'll see you guys a little bit later. But you know what? Let's head on right inside and uh, I'm going to show you how um, the table is going and um, how players are actually reacting. I know a couple of people are actually winning, some are losing, but, uh, you know, um, the spirit is still high, the sportsmanship is still high. But yeah, I'll see you guys in a little bit.
Look at the banter, guys. <laughs> yeah. I'm following you. The game is like, oh, I will slide here for you. You slid. No! no. <laughs> the game said, no, see, I've got you. Let me slide for you. Yeah, but the game want to help you, you know? No. It's like, yeah, look. It's like a nice pair of arms. Look, 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 <laughs> oh yeah. Well, no. See, he was he was very passionate. Look at my love. He, he, There's he, no passion in the game. Listen, there was passion. <laughs> I spent many hours in the game. No, no, no. no, no, no. Like, <laughs> look, let's look at Ben Argo. Look, look, look at CJ goals. Want to see? Want to see highlights? <laughs> want to see highlights of goals? Uh, you right here, guys. One more. One more. I'm done. So we're the way. All right, guys, uh, we're out here um, with the four players. I think playing, having some, you know, kickoff. So I'm here representing, you know, Kaku TV, of course. We got our, you know, top bins life kit. We got a pen. <laughs> oh! <laughs> How you doing, bro? <laughs> Good to see you. <laughs> all right these were my teammates oh my we all look tired we all britain so dave <laughs> how's that half we got mr cj bro that's just like playing no world football bro. he's playing volta <laughs> <laughs> how are you how was it good stuff bro hello tired, tired. nice nice how about you how do you feel cheated <laughs> more cheated <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's so far so good, guys. Um, <sighs> we'll be having lots of fun here, man. So far so good. It's been amazing. Uh, we're breathing like, you know, breathing like I'm breathing like a cow right now. But so far so good, man. We're loving it. We're having lots of fun. Uh, I'll give you guys some updates here shortly. Yeah. Yeah. All right, guys. Um, as you guys can see, it's another day. Um, yesterday was the um, qualifiers. Um, and the top three from Group A and Group B, you know, made it. So we had um, Adanavi, Thiago Capo, and we got um, CJ on uh, in Group A, that topped the Group A. And for Group B, Group B, we had um, K1 John coming up first. Um, second was um, Do Star, and the third was NR7. So the six of them are, six of them are going to actually play um, live uh, on the main stage on Sunday. But right now, what we're about to do is about to go to uh, we're about to go to the Q2 Stadium. We're about to go watch the game between uh, Austin FC and St. Louis um, Soccer Club. So yeah, we'll see what happens. I'm gonna you know get some some clips and, and stuff like that. Stay tuned. All right, guys, we're live at uh, the Q2 Stadium. Still watching the game though. It's been fun so far, so good, man. It's been really amazing, man. <laughs>
So as you guys can see, hey, 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 nice. He just gave it. He just gave his kids. Yeah, to to a kid, man. So that's really good. That's really good. So yeah, that's really amazing. Um, and uh, yeah, <laughs> getting that signed as well. So yeah. yeah. Um, you know, show some love. Show some love <laughs> like that. <laughs> He gave me the key to love it, love it, love it. Amazing, man. Yeah. Hey, bro. Yeah. <laughs> nice, nice. Well done. Congrats. Yes, <laughs> yeah. So, yeah, um, as you can see, um, that was really amazing. The game ended 2 2. St. Louis um, came back with a um, with a um, 93rd minute equalizer, uh, which was really amazing, man. Uh, honestly, um, they fought back, they got that. Yeah. So, guys, um, that was fun. Um, I'll be catching you guys a little bit later. Um, and uh, hey guys, I need to go get some rest tonight. Uh, and I'll catch you guys tomorrow for the actual, um, you know, EMLS Cup. And we'll see who wins tomorrow. But yeah, before the game starts or before they start playing the matches, I will, you know, um, you know, give you guys some content, you know, some pre game content as well. So, right, see you guys later. Bye for now. Yeah, all right, all right, guys. We are live at the ACL for the uh official emls cup um this is going to be amazing folks um yeah we are right pretty much before um the players so we could capture the players entrance so yeah i will um i will literally show you guys here shortly um when the players arrive but for now i need to show you guys something we did that last year but we're going to do it again this year so yeah take a look And you know the vibes. I just showed you guys uh, the whole kit uh, for virtually all the EMLS, uh, you know, for all the MLS clubs anyways. Uh, but so far so good, it's been amazing. Um, awesome, awesome. So yeah, um, I'm gonna go here just to show you guys what the state looks like. So you, can, you guys can see exactly what I'm talking about. Hold on. All right guys, we're literally inside the venue before the folks arrive. But yeah, let me show you guys exactly what it looks like before it starts getting packed. All right. Let's take a look. Just look at the stage. Pretty amazing. Um, looking really, really awesome. All right, we're having fun uh, playing against our man uh, himself. Uh, we played uh, against each other in a couple of, um, you know, tournaments as well. Um, and he, he always beat me. But I'm glad we're playing live. And right now the score is 0-0 zero, zero at, at halftime. So yes, we're doing good. <laughs> we're doing good. <laughs> yep. <laughs> so awesome. So guys, we'll be right back. Let's see what it ends. <laughs> so yeah, guys, um, he won. My one goes. I think. I think I improved. I tried. So how was it? Right. <laughs> awesome. I appreciate you, man. How do you feel? How do you feel? Feels good. Um, first year. Hopefully more. Um, it's good to just pick up experience. You know. Um, being around people, the big stage, it's definitely something you just have to experience. And I feel like, for me, it's been a good year as a rookie, and I can't wait for next year, man. Awesome. We have folks checking in, uh, getting the tickets. Yeah, man, it's amazing, man. Love to see We got my Nigerian brothers. Look at them coming in. The big boys, the boys from the Bay. Look at them, man. My Nigerian brothers, look at them, bro. <laughs> Yeah. 
Yo, 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 guys, um, we got the main man, uh, you know, the pro player for YCAP FC. How are you feeling generally when it comes to, you know, participating in um, the EMLS Cup, you know, qualifiers? Yeah. Or, I, have, have you been, how are you feeling about it? It's all new, you know. Um, I didn't know what to expect coming in. I obviously knew the players are professionals. They put in the time, you know, they're at the highest level. Yes. So I wasn't coming in thinking I can beat these guys, but I came in to learn the space, you know, provide a little bit more exposure, meet new people and understand the industry. So it's been good. It's been right. good. How do you prioritize your time and your you know personal life, your personal activities, your work <laughs> and all of this stuff? How do you do that? I don't put in as much time as everyone else, obviously, just my first ever circuit with the guys. Um, but yeah, it's all about balance, you know, making sure you handle the things you need to do, your work, your responsibilities. But then when you do have that free time at night, getting in those games, you know, whether it's rivals, whether it's uh, Champions League, whatever. It's been good. It's been good though. When you played the first game, like what was your reaction as to, you know, how the game went? You know, did you try to be like, oh my goodness, this is crazy or were you be like, oh yeah, I can do better than what I just did? No, I was shook. Absolutely shook. You know, there's people at home, you know, they play casually, you know, they put in like, you know, they play pastime, like part-time playing and they think they can compete with the pros. No, it's a different level. Who do you think is the most craziest opponent or the craziest player that you think might win it? I mean, Lamps beat me 23 0. <laughs> He's like one of the only players that got 20 on me, which is crazy. Right. Yeah, because I remember playing him as well just for fun. And yeah. man, he just slaughtered me. Of course. You know, um, but what I did was I recorded the game. Okay. And I went through and looked at what he was doing that I was doing differently. And, you know, I think that improved my gameplay as well. So, that's yeah, good, it's that's been, good advice it's, too, yeah, watching it's been, it over. And, yep, you know, it's yep. similar to real life as a professional. Exactly. Like you play a game, you go into the video room with the analyst, you start right. watching the little things that you right. could have done better. Because sometimes it's a touch this way or a touch that way yep. or a decision this way yep. or this decision. So it's similar to professional, yes, sir. you know, professional yes, sir. soccer. Yeah, I just want to say a big thank you to you uh, for taking the moment, you know, to chat with us. It's just amazing. We respect, you know, folks like you the pro players all of you guys you guys are amazing so thank you so much again brother. thank you man keep you. doing what you're doing yes sir sorry and you can see the embrace between the two players. Good friends, amazing competitors, an amazing season for them, and it's sad to see Dean CJ go, but it does mean that that's a result of United the world. But it's certainly the final. Very impressive, Jafonzo waiting for him in the quarterfinals as we get now the confirmation that FC Dallas will be progressing, knocking out Dorska and the New York Red Bull. So, congratulations to Alan Harvey. Great to see him back on the stage. Thank you. 
we're gonna make it. Just hold. There we yeah. go. Yeah. I have to run around with you guys. I saw here a little bit. All right, thanks, guys. Uh, we had a few nominees today for our TikTok moment of the day. Mike and Dan, let's watch these. Let's break. Oh, guys, we we'll present to you um, the latest EMLS champion here, right here. So, how do you feel, bro? Feeling really good, right. as you can see. Uh, yeah. Qualified well, World Cup, win right. the title. Right. Yeah. Today yeah. was a good day. Nice. Yeah, you won the LS2, right? Yeah. And now you're winning EMLS. Um, what, like, what did you do differently from LS1 to LS2 uh, and like, EMLS Cup? I think LS1 was also playing really good. Mm -hmm. I lost to Paul Nate in quarter final. Mm -hmm. But I think that was a bad game for me mm -hmm. because the level was the same, I believe. Right. So I was just keep confident and yeah, that's it. So what advice do you have for like people that are still learning? What advice specifically do you have for them uh, to improve yourself? Practice a lot, obviously. Right. Mm -hmm. Watch professionals, mm -hmm. do to see what they do. And and yeah, have, uh, first of all, have passion for the game. Right. That's the, for me, that's the main. Perfect. Thank you so much Thank for you. taking a moment. Thank you so much. Let me, um, he's, he's just amazing, amazing player. Um, so I, I, I know you lost the final, but I, I know it's painful. But um, how, how do you feel generally, you know, with the, with the tournament and, you know, how you play till you go to the final? Yeah, you know, there is, we cannot name a lot of players that make it back-to-back. -back. Right. Back-to-back to, -back to, uh, to the World Cup. It's just different, you know. Right. So I'm so happy with it, even though I lost the final. Mm -hmm. So sad about it. But yeah, I understand. Yeah, when you see the trophy in front of your eyes, it's just right. different. You know? Right. So, yeah, I'm happy with how I, how I played today, how I qualified, mm -hmm. but I'm just so sad about the last game. I understand. It was tough, you know, but we move. Yeah, because last year, you know, you were able to play in competitive, you know, yeah. you, you were just behind the scene, you were just slaying yeah, people. Yeah. People were saying, man, K1 John is going to come and just destroy, yeah. you know, any, and, you know, and you came, you made everyone <laughs> proud, you qualified for World, you know, World Cup last year, you came again today, now you've qualified for it again. Mm -hmm. You know, what advice do you have for people that, you know, I still in the game and yeah. uh, that want to get better. What advice do you have for them? Okay, the way I'm, I started the, the play, even before to be like before being professional, I wasn't professional at all. I was just playing in a cyber or anything, and that's what I did. I was just playing tournaments in cyber tournaments online, just playing tournaments to play people that are better than me. Right. This is what I was doing, and it helped me to be way better. Nice. So you know, this is the only advice I can give. Mm -hmm. Keep chasing your dream. Play tournaments, try mm -hmm. to improve, watch professional players, and you will get it, you know? Exactly. Yeah. So, yeah, you're from Africa, like well, myself, Egypt, of course. Yeah. yeah, I'm from Nigeria. So, yes, yeah, it's, uh, it's really amazing to see someone from Africa, you know, coming yeah. into any and just dominating as well. So, yeah, congratulations again, my brother. So much, Thank man. you so much, Thank bro. You. Well done. Yeah, guys, look at that. We made it back to Kansas City. Um, amazing, amazing, uh, amazing trip to Austin for the EMLS Cup. Yeah, awesome, man. That was amazing, man. Honestly. Uh, we had uh, we had so much fun. We vibed. I um, you know, I just want to say a big thank you to um, EMLS for the invitation. Um, if you like um, contents like this, make sure uh, you give um, our YouTube a sub. Greatly appreciate it. Um, and also watch us live on Twitch TV slash Captain TV with an underscore behind it. Honestly, man, it's been amazing. I'll see you guys a little bit later. Bye for now.